Hey guys, I just want to talk to you a second real quick. I'm about to head into the office here for another day. It's Thursday the 25th and I just got done at the gym. Like I said, I'm heading into the office and I wanted to mention this. It's that when you're working out or doing things, riding, whatever it is, and if you feel a joint, a muscle that's saying, hey, this doesn't feel right. And it's not just like a regular ache and pain. It's a, you know, like hmm, something might tear if I keep going stop what you're doing, be mindful, take the break, take what you need to do to get it done, and then go back to work. You don't have to prove anything and be this macho person and be Superman or Superwoman and push past it and then you get yourself in an injury or a wreck. So this morning at the gym, my knee was saying, hey, no more. So I said, all right, cool. I backed off, went and did some core work, uh, rolled out on the lacrosse ball, did some cardio, even did the elliptical, which I don't love, and I got my work done, but I worked around it. So tonight heading to the chiropractor after I ride we'll see where we're at because for me a knee injury isn't worth isn't worth trying to push through a workout so again be mindful do what you need to do but don't don't put yourself at risk don't risk blowing out your knee for me it's not worth the knee injury like I said but it's also not worth uh you know, potentially limiting my riding for this year this season I have goals and so I want to be careful with it so again Take the time that you need, foam roll, lacrosse, ball roll, whatever you want to call it. Do your mobility, see so chiropractor, soft tissue, what you need to do to keep your body healthy. All right, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you in the next clip. Getting ready to ride, but I just want to show you guys this view. Okay, come on now. Freaking amazing, gorgeous Colorado out here. It's almost, I think, 5 p.m. on, uh, what is today? The 25th? Like, what? I think that's amazing. Ooh, get some light. There we go. Hi, guys. There are the kids. We're uh, just trying to patch you tonight. I gotta, gotta go to town. Chiropractor at 745. Body freaking hurts. That's, let me tell you. It hurts. Four foot surgeries, back injuries, hip injury, and it's not even the worst. It, like, it's just not that bad but it hurts. <laughs> so I'm gonna go into town, get worked on, meeting up with a friend at seven for coffee. Trust me, I'm not drinking, well, maybe drinking, maybe drinking coffee. Just got done with the caffeine cleanse, so I don't need to be drinking a lot of coffee. Anyway, I just wanted to show you guys that view, cause this, what? That's so pretty. Holy smokes, that is so pretty. It really is. One more time. One more time for good measure. <laughs> oh, man. Anyway, I am uh, hauling horses down either Friday night, just tomorrow, or very early Saturday morning. Um, let me get back in. Back in light. Whew, there we go. So either tomorrow, Friday night, or early, early Saturday morning. Horse show Sunday with that guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So it'll be fun, it'll be a good time. All right, we'll see you in the next clip. Hey y'all, how's it going? It is Saturday, the 27th, January. I am headed down to Castle Rock. Got the horses loaded up, it's about 5.30 in the morning. Got up this morning about 3.30 with intentions of leaving by four. Went promptly back to sleep, woke up at 4.45 and still made it out of the house by five got to the horses got them loaded up in about 20 minutes so worked out real well uh yeah pretty excited horse shows tomorrow uh then i'll get back up here to Greeley area get horses turned back and go back to work on monday so uh yeah i'll uh tune in with you guys in the next clip because i'm sure there's going to be an amazing sunrise these colorado sunrises are probably one of the best in the country and i'm, am kind of biased you know but whatever <laughs> anyway i'll see you guys in the next clip
loaded up, getting ready to head to the horse show. Whoopie's in a pin, Patch is in the trailer. We're ready to go. This is the arena for today. Here we go. Hey guys, thank you for tuning into another video of Road to the Buckle. Uh, Apache and I did end up winning the overall at that show, so that was really exciting. We've got four more shows left in the series before, uh, well, before it ends. And so yeah, we'll stay tuned. Uh, give it a like, give us a follow and a share, and we'll catch you in the next one.